You know, it's incredible to think that a film festival would come to our fair little town, but actually this is the 15th year it's happened here. So to learn a little more, I have with me Patty Lawn from the Chilliwack Arts Council. Now, what is the Chilliwack International Film Series? Well, it is something that has um, 15 seasons under its belt, and the Arts Council had a fabulous volunteer who came forward 15 seasons ago and mm -hmm. said, you know what, Chilliwack needs a film series. And we were behind it, and we've grown since then in numbers and enthusiastic audiences, and I think brought a lot of really interesting films to our community. So why? Why, why did we need one? <laughs> why one did things? we need that? Yeah. Well, you know, it's really nice to have a community theater to show it in, and um, our committee has selected some films that you wouldn't normally think of bringing into a bigger uh, venue. Uh, you might not get the market for it. And we've had films that have come from different countries, uh, recommended by the Toronto International Film Festival. Wonderful titles, little sleeper movies that you wouldn't think would be big hits. They're shown at a film series first, and then they go on to do amazing things. And you can say, hey, I saw it first there. Some with subtitles and um, some amazing actors that you wouldn't see in these wonderful little little films. Have you been surprised in the past film festivals you've come to? I have. You know, you see the title, you see the actor, um, you might not necessarily know them, but you know, eventually they end up in bigger and better things. But uh, some of the selections have been amazing. So what are you guys playing this year? What's that this year, well tonight is our opening night, so we have the Grand Seduction, which I'm really excited to see because I think Gordon Pinsett is amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, I am pleased to announce that a doctor is coming for one month. If the doctor chooses to stay here, we get the factory. What do the factory make? They make jobs. We also have upcoming, we have uh, The Railway Man, October 1st, Magic in the Moonlight, and honestly, if people love Woody Allen, this is another one of his wonderful, quirky movies. And we have Land Ho, Calvary, and Boyhood. And Boyhood is really intriguing because they have followed an actor for 12 years. So this is an interesting concept, and I'm really looking forward to our closing night show. And what day is that one? That one is going to be October 29th, and it follows one actor over the course of 12 years from boyhood to college. Okay, so of the list, mm -hmm. which one are you really, you really, really want to see that you're really curious about? This well, about tonight, Grand Seduction. Yeah. really want to see it, but boyhood. I'm really, really looking forward to boyhood, yeah. So what is your favorite thing about this film series? What, what do you love about it? I think it brings out community. I think it brings out a lot of people who've been coming to them. They look forward to it spring and fall. They can't wait to get their hands on the selections. They buy their season's passes. We see them at every show. They're here. We have loyal, faithful followers. Um, but we would like to get the word out to everybody that this is a great way to support community, support film, and just have a wonderful night out. Thank you.